The Medford Smooth Criminal. By the way, props out to Knifeworks. They gave me this nice little mouse pad right here. Didn't expect it with my order, but when I got my Medford, I got a nice mouse pad with it. So, kind of like a baseball glove. Looks really nice. So, the Medford Smooth Criminal, I've had on my list for a little while. I kind of jumped on it because... Well, a few things aligned, but I I think like everybody, I really like button locks. I enjoy them. And price-wise, this was kind of what I was looking for. I traditionally stick to USA-made knives if possible. And um, so I always kind of had this one on my list, but it's been jumping up in price. Uh, really glad I got it. Short and stubby little knife. Um, when I first got it, the deployment, the detent on it was way too strong. It was taking skin off my finger and it was not enjoyable to use it in any way. But after I would say about 50, 60 flips, uh, it just broke in really nice. And now it's smooth as glass. I know online I've heard kind of that in the beginning they had problems with super light detents, but I haven't found that to be case in any way you can flip out by just using the button lock if you want i thought that the bail hook or the uh lanyard loop would be painful digging into the hand it's not you you really don't feel it i could do without it that would be nice it looks like also they've uh put everything into s45 vn that's kind of nice because i think that they were standard s35 uh, it does have the proprietary hardware it's a little heavy. It's I'm not I don't have specs in front of me, but um, I kind of assume that there's not much milling inside of the there's no milling actually inside of the aluminum. It's only on the outside. The anodization is very smooth, very nicely done. No patches or missing areas at all. Came out with a nice deep and dark blue. Um, the the only other thing I've heard from people is that this flipper is a little small. It is a little small, but it's got enough purchase on it, and it's got enough gnarling or jimping on it to actually catch and uh, deploy no problem. Uh, I think that the closest competitor that I would say to uh, apples to apples, oranges to oranges, is probably going to be the ProTech Malibu. Um, it's... Uh, you know, a button lock, it's American made, it's in the same price range. And uh, I think if you're looking for to, to enjoy an EDC, something that's going to take care of most cutting tasks, either one is going to be fine. Um, I do, however, have to say, I don't know if it's because I've had it longer or I just think it's more of a refined feel that the ProTech Malibu kind of would win out if I had to pick just one. Now, I'd, I'd be sad to get rid of the Medford. I really have grown to like it. I've carried it uh, quite a bit. And so that's not to say that the Medford is bad in any way. It's short and chunky, and so the only other short and chunky knife I kind of have to compare it to is the Benchmade 300 SN that has been discontinued. Uh, they discontinue all the great knives through Benchmade, but it is uh, short and chunky also. And that's kind of what you get is you get uh, kind of a nice full grip uh, with a smaller uh, blade. Um, there, there are advantages to it. And, and carryability, this knife right here, has a better blade to handle ratio than that uh, Benchmade 300 SN. Um, you know, really comparatively, you do get a shorter handle here, but you get plenty of cutting length here with the kind of grind that Medford used. It's it's supposed to be like a, a high hollow grind, but when you feel it, it's pretty hard to feel the hollowness. Um, so I'm not sure exactly what I would call this kind of a grind. Pretty thick blade stock as well. Uh, but everything fit and finish on this is phenomenal. Solid lockup. Uh, attention to detail. I think Medford was going for that budget knife. And it doesn't feel like a budget knife. It feels like a high-end EDC. It's very enjoyable to carry. Um, I don't know if I said this already, but the pocket clip just works very nicely in the pants and situates the knife uh, just exactly where I like to carry. So if you have any questions about the Medford Smooth Criminal, please let me know. Really enjoy carrying this one and uh, 
Hope this helps somebody making a decision right now, okay? You guys take care.